And a new search today for missing Durango teen Dylan Redwine. Good afternoon, I'm Kim Baez. Search crews were back at Vallecito Reservoir today looking for any sign of 14-year-old Dylan Redwine. It's an area they have searched many times in the five months Redwine has been missing with no results. But officials say cadaver dogs got another hit in that area just a couple days ago. You can see from Sky News 13, the group taking a very close look at the northern end of the reservoir. Now, La Plata County Sheriff's spokesman Dan Bender says they've built what they call a coffer dam to section off that area so that they can pump the water out and do a more in-depth search. You can also see crews digging in the nearby sand looking for clues. Searchers say with the snow in that area melted, they can now take a better look everywhere around there. Red wine has been missing since November 19th. His father, Mark, says he went to run errands, and when he returned, Dylan was gone. Well, Mark has been questioned several times about his son's disappearance. Investigators have not publicly called him a suspect. Dylan's mother did go on the Dr. Phil show in February, accusing him of doing something to their son. Did you hurt him? No, Elaine, I wouldn't hurt him. What kind of mother do you are you to even think that I was capable of doing something like I that? While investigators have been back out at the reservoir today, they have not said if they have found anything. They have been there at least 15 times since red wine disappeared, but each time they have found nothing. Cadaver dogs have been taken through that area several times and have picked up scents several times. Well, Vallecito Reservoir continues to be a main focus in this search. Investigators say it is possible Dylan is anywhere. There is still a reward for information leading to Dylan's whereabouts. It's at about $30,000.